Hey everyone, this is Sarah from HappyBrownHouse.com and today I'm going to show you um, how to use YouTube playlists to um, personalize the, the learning in your homeschool. Um, this is something that I learned um, and used in my public school classroom and um, now we're using it with homeschool and it's just a, a really great way to bring technology into the class room and so it's really easy first thing is you will have to have um, a YouTube account now if you have a Gmail or any sort of Google account it's already attached so um, just log in and then this is what your home screen will look like um, and on the left hand side here we have um, playlists and then you, these are some uh, playlists that I have already done in the past and um, some of these were kindergarten units and um, now I am this year we're, um, we're going to start doing second grade so I have started um, a YouTube playlist for our um, curriculum which is my father's world and we're going to be doing adventures in US history which is second grade so um, just really quickly, I'm going to show you um, how to make a playlist. Now, you can hover over playlist and click it. And you can add a new playlist. Um, and we're just going to um, just make up. We're going to... Uh, Um, one one really easy way you could do this with uh, younger children is that, you know if you're going to be doing certain songs for the calendar time or um, anything really you can set that up so uh, we're just going to say calendar songs and then um, I will create it now you can have your playlist set up um, right now it's set to public or you can change it to private um, it really doesn't matter that's up to you now um, so I know that there are some days of the week oops, days of the week songs out there and um, there's usually some fun little videos that come with it so um, the first two are ads um, so we'll just pick um, days of the week I don't really care. This is just pretend. So, um, okay, I'm not going to let that play, um, but I know that the learning station is a good one. Um, but so, if I if it if I previewed the video and I liked it and I wanted to add it to my playlist, let's scroll down a little bit and hover over add to and then calendar songs which is the right playlist now another thing is you can scroll down a little bit and you can add a note so say um, you're using this for a particular curriculum and maybe it's for a week um, week one um, then you could write that note so that way you could remember oh that goes with that particular unit um, add your note and then it's there and you can keep adding to your playlist um, now when you go back to YouTube to the home it will be in our playlist there it is okay so now um, whenever I'm ready to go ahead and start with our playlist and um, now I can just come in I can push play all or I can choose a certain one to play the other thing is you can um, move them around by hovering you move them to the top you can make notes um, and then if you want to remove it you could press on the X 
so um, it's just really easy here is a, a sneak peek at our um, my father's world one for our second grade and um, I've, already <laughs> I've already found over a hundred videos um, starting with the Pledge of Allegiance and sign language and then we're going to talk about Leif Erikson and the Vikings and then we're going to talk about Columbus and globes and the continents and oh goodness we're going to have so much fun so there are tons of great videos out there and um, go use them they're just at your fingertips and they're free and it's um, a great way to um, add media to your um, homeschool day um, the other way, thing that I think is so important is you can um, take a virtual field trip for instance this one um, right here is uh, looking at what life was like in the Pil Plymouth colony so we're gonna go actually see what life was like in the colony and um, you know it, it's a virtual field trip in a way so um, I hope that this helps answer any questions and if you have more um, make sure to um, add them in the comments of the blog post um, once again this is Sarah from happybrownhouse.com and